Okay, hello dear friends. Good evening. Such a beautiful, beautiful evening. And I just bought this new clothes. It's very, very comfortable. So I'm wearing it. So uh, this video is, um, let me see. Why do I change glasses? Anyway, <laughs> this video is um, kind of answering friends' question. And uh, one friend mentioned, Haiying, uh, you are almost getting 70,000. And are you planning to do something special? Actually, originally I was trying to do a 67,000 special because um, uh, my subscriber growing very, very slow, 10 subscribers a day or something. So I have done a calculation. And if I have a 10 a day, then every year I can get uh, 3,000 to 4,000, let's say 4,000. And I have uh, 40, thousand until i reach uh, i reach a hundred silver plate so it will take me 10 years until i get uh, the 100,000 subscribers so um so the other day i i was thinking i must be already too old or if i keep that uh, momentum and um never thought about it so i so i was thinking sixty seven thousand might be a good landmark and then something happened these uh, recent days the first thing i think um, there was a very very successful and smart and uh, very successful nice nice person uh, uh, youtuber uh, asthma youtuber and uh, she's uh, GB and GB did uh, a trivia and during this trivia there was uh, who is the most uh, um, who is the most subscriber who is the most influential who is the oldest who is the earliest there was one that is who is the, the most uh, asthma video and um, and uh, in that she mentioned uh, that was me uh, 13,000 and uh, I think from that because she has um, a big subscriber base and uh, she's very successful so her shout out really brought a lot of new subscriber to me and uh, I think uh, one thing after another, this kind of energy is just accumulating. And then a couple of uh, days ago, I got um, uh, a video recommended how to practice, how to uh, explain and pra practice Chinese calligraphy. And that, that video went to a lot of people's uh, recommendation feed so suddenly i got uh, a lot of subscribers so it's almost 10 times as i used to to get so suddenly i got uh, a lot it's quite uh, to my surprise one thing it shows is that uh, youtube is very unpredictable you never know how the YouTube algorithm start to favor you or disregard you. And uh, this couple of days, YouTube algorithm uh, did me a favor. But um, very soon or very suddenly, it could uh, just disappear, all these things. So I was thinking if I should do this, uh, uh, a subscriber special or not and uh, how about if I do it and then I exhaust all the good luck good karma and then no subscriber come in 
But on the other hand, but, uh, on the other hand I am not making video for gaining subscribers and this was from the very beginning my very thought so so I decide maybe we just uh, take this opportunity to have some fun so this video is dedicated to the person at the time of uh, of uh, of this video publishing however this number i will write this number for now this number my subscriber number is let me go to my for now is 72471 and uh, at the moment of um, of uh, publishing if it is a seven two four seven two or three i will just write that number i think this random arbitrary run number can represent a more uniqueness and the more commonality of you and i we are not selected people we are not selected number we are just the number given and uh, but we are special and the number that you occupy the number i occupy the number whoever occupy is unique is the most important so i will dedicate to that but at the same time i am thinking uh, what I can do to support me, to support my channel growth, channel growth, is to sell on Ichi some of my uh, my prints, and uh, I have an an Ichi shop to sell these things, to sell my prints, and to sell brush and. Uh, and uh, art supplies art supplies i cannot make any price discount because i got, got it in china it's unique i fly there and get the things take it back so not talking about shipping just my airplane ticket is already a lot and uh, i cannot compare or i cannot compete with other mass one one wonders you you already know but um, but this art prints <laughs> it's printing money <laughs> in a very heartless way to say but uh, it's the accumulation of my work of my practice of my 50 60 years of practice and I accumulate those practice into a very humble, very minimal skill and um, to make it, to print it, to, to, to paint it. And uh, it's something that out of my heart and uh, the cost is already in my life and uh, I can adjust that price. So I am doing 80% off all of this I will generate a code and um, you get 80% off you get 80% 20% discount you pay 80% of of this this is the only way I can I can do it's not I am not doing you a favor it is you who is doing me a favor For the people who is uh, having trouble, who is in this stressed situation. So check out my online shop and uh, <laughs> support me. And um, something I do not know how... Uh, let me just stop a little bit so that uh, that sound can... We do not make noise to 
to think about them. Okay, so here I will just take this opportunity to a little bit of my my thought on this YouTube algorithm. And uh, if you are a YouTuber, you you if you decide YouTube is your career, it is very much dependent on the YouTube algorithm. And the YouTube algorithm is. Uh, it's a very unpredictable thing. It's not rewarding hard work from what I experience. It's not rewarding hard work. And it's, it's so much about a luck. So if you are making YouTube and nobody notice you, do not be discouraged. It's nothing wrong with you. Maybe just you are not yet covered, discovered. And, uh, and uh, it's not because you are doing anything wrong or you are not as good as others. You are nothing inferior than others. And what I got other people notice for this couple of days in another couple of days, all this will be gone and I will go to 10 subscribers a day, keep on like that. So it's just a pure luck. See? But on the other hand, it's kind of the accumulation of labor. Once you accumulate enough of your labor, you might have a chance to be noticed. And uh, luck does not fall to the people who has, who has no base. You have to build some of the base. And it's a, life is a combination of luck, hard work, and all these uh, funny things we do not understand. And uh, the more important thing is to chase our heart and do the things that uh, really inspire us, makes us happy. As I have said, YouTube makes me a better person. And in real, in real life, I am... <laughs> I am a loser. I am a loser. Nobody noticed me. And YouTube is kind of my second life. I remember when I first started around 10 years ago, or actually 15 years ago or something, I was in Australia and um, sometimes we had friends, we went out. And there was one time we went to um, Byron Bay or some place near Sydney. I forgot that exactly place. We went to that place. We rent a house with another family. And uh, in the night, we fall asleep and some sleep some read book in the common room and I was doing video and things imagine 15 years ago almost 20 years ago and uh, then um, my friend said oh gosh you really have a second life and that was um, that was the, 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 the first time I was uh, so much into that at that time I make a lot of video uh, just to make an upload and um, nobody knows that uh, nobody could imagine that an ordinary person can can rake up 70,000 subscribers I do not understand I do not understand uh, my current luck yeah, this couple of days luck. It will be gone, I know. And um, let it be whatever. Que sera, sera, whatever will be, will be. Duh.
future is not us to seek it out, it So, um, so I think uh, a lot of uh, this uh, YouTube or social media or or anything, it depends on how you use it. You can use it to make your your life more interesting, or you can use use it to make your life uh, uh, not that interesting, become very stressful. Just avoid those competition to show off. Well, I am showing off, and um, and live your life so I really appreciate your support and I have something that in my heart I cannot get over and I will not go into deeper but um, but uh, as a mother if you are a parent the thing that hurts you the most it's not yourself suffering. It's not the problem of yourself. Your life suffer. You can deal with it. Deal with it. If my life had problem, I can deal with it. Things that hurts me the most is our family, our children. When our children have trouble have difficulty in doing homework, in finishing project, in task, and later on um, make friends, and later on building family. These are the things that, uh, that really uh, really makes me makes my heart heavy. Mm. I used to tell my son, I say, uh, if they got hurt, for example, they, 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 go, they run and fell down, or do something, have a cut or paper cut, or any of these things, and uh, if they fail for an exam, if they, they didn't finish a project or, or blamed by others or, 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 or criticized by teachers or didn't because they didn't do the work, anything, even if anything, if they are having a hard time, trouble, I say, do you feel pain? If you are pain now, you time it by 10, that's how your mother feels. And that is truth, and that is true. If you are hurt, your mother will be feeling, will feel 10 times more pain than you because she is your mother or she is your father because we are parents. Thank you very, very, very much. I love you. I really do. Do, 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 do. And also, you can suggest some other ideas to celebrate this, let's say, 80,000 or let's say 70,000. If you have an idea, right now I am thinking of 80% because I'm aiming at getting 80,000 subscribers and I don't know how long it will take another two years let it be and um, and uh, if you have any idea to celebrate it to make it special write it down I will do it bye bye friends I love you I really do 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 bye bye